prosecuting marijuana is a sin against God. Standing by while it's done is a sin against God. Marijuana is from God. Marijuana is for the healing of the nations. I will take any challenge. Come and look in my eye. I'm not going to look at any comment. I see what's happening today. <clears throat> I see the type of virus that come after me from yesterday and today. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. What type of virus? I get... Very look, I've gotten very high virus all from these special low level controller internet controller virus that come out of Spain, like blue coat. But yesterday or today, I got well, all right, the last one came through my YouTube channel page, the post button. Inside YouTube, you got, well, we know, whatever, but I know. Ajax, and, okay, this one, listen to BBC radio stream, all right? You listen to BBC, they come up with some player. BBC can code into the audio stream a command to lick you out based on your MAC address which is linked up off of your Facebook post. Yeah. If you're on a certain level and you go and post on the Facebook, pop, pop, pop. Okay. Anyways, the other thing is the use of censorship. And you know, here's with people. You don't know how to argue with each other. You don't know how to reason. You don't know how to live with each other anymore. If you, you, I know you. You don't know how to live with each other. People have emotions. People have emotions. People are different, creative. We are different. We are not equal. Equality is a false concept. I'm sorry. Equality is a false concept. We are all different. The only place you find equality is on a much higher level when you're talking higher levels. On our dimension here, you don't have equality. That's a false concept. That's like telling you to go look for something that's not there. It's not nice what they do with their democracy. If you want to understand where democracy thoughts in your mind came from, study this little boy, Edward Bernays, like around 1915, how he got connected with the Freemasons in the White House and World War I, peace to go and everything, whatever they did. And he's with fluoride and a lot of programming in your minds. Um, fluoride, Hitler knew fluoride coded people into zombies and gave fluoride to the people in the camps. And fluoride, there's a big connection between fluoride and the warmongers, you know, who, who have the aluminum company and make their war machines. Do your research. Connect the dots. The web is high above us.
give thanks.